Good morning everyone and welcome to your maths class. Today we will continue with our NCRT maths book. So, everyone quickly take out your NCRT maths book and your pencil eraser. Today we will do chapter number 10, tens and ones part 2. Already we have done part 1. So, today we will continue with part 2. Page number 80, 2 at a time, Chintu and Mintu. Can you see in the picture Chintu and Mintu? Yes, went shopping. They bought some things. To pay they used notes and coins, but only two at a time. What are the notes and coins they have? Note, they have 10 rupee note, 50 rupees note and 20 rupees note and coins they have 1 rupee coin, 5 rupee coin and 2 rupee coin. Out of these which two can they use to buy the things below? They can use the same note or coin more than one time. That means they can use any two either one note or a coin or both the notes or they can use same note twice understood children now the first thing the first item is a bat can you see the bat yes the price tag is rupees 20 so how many notes they have used two notes of rupees 10 makes 20 okay now coming to the next item that is a notebook of rupees 10 so now you say children which two notes or coins or a mixture of both will they use to buy this rupees 10? Yes, they will use two 5 rupee coins to buy it. Then there is the ball. The price of the ball is rupees 40. Now children tell which notes or coins they will use. Yes, they will use 20 rupees note twice. Very good. The next item is a shirt of rupees 60. So, how many notes will they use? For rupees 60, which notes they will use? Yes, yes, they will use rupees 50 and a note of rupees 10 to make rupees 60. The next item is a doll of rupees 25. So, which notes and coins what they will use? Yes, they will use a note of rupees 20 and a coin of rupees 5. So, children you will do it yourself. Page number 80. I have explained. So, you will do it yourself. Understood? Now, coming to page number 82, killer lizard, a lizard moves from one hole to another, as it moves it eats insects hidden in the hole, the number of insects in each hole is shown, yes we can see the number of ins insects in each hole, there are two, one, 0, 8, 9, 6, 3 and 5 and did you have you seen the blue circle where we are having the lizard the hungry lizard yes. Now starting from the blue hole in the picture the lizard goes to 3 holes to eat 18 insects the first question is of 18 insects. So did you understand? Starting from the blue hole in the picture, the lizard goes to three holes to eat 18 insects. And the lizard can move only along the lines. Okay. Now, starting from the blue hole, 18 insects. So, 8 plus, plus 1 plus 9. Can you see the red line? Yes. 
So, 8 plus 1 plus 9 makes 18. Now, coming to the next question, what path can the lizard take to eat 12 insects? So, he has to eat go to the 3 holes to eat 12 insects. What path can the lizard take to eat 12 insects? So, which part it will take to eat 12 insects? Yes children. So, it will take the path of starting from 2, then 1, then yes 9. So, 2 plus 1 plus 9 becomes 12. So, 2 plus 1 plus 9 equals to 12. Now, coming to the next question, what part can the lizard take to eat 20 insects? And we are having how many holes here? Yes, we are having 3 holes. So, which part he will take? Yes, which one? Yes, he will start from 8, then go to 9 and 3. So, it will take the path from 8, then 9 and 3. So, 8 plus 9 plus 3 equals to 20. Now, the next question. This time the lizard goes to 4 holes to eat insects. What path does the lizard take to eat 18 insects? 4 holes and total is 18 insects. So, which path it will take? Yes. So, the lizard will start from 6 then go to 3, 8 and 1. So, 6 plus 3 plus 8 plus 1 will give you a total of 18. Coming to the last question that is what path does the lizard take for 12 insects? Here again we are having 4 holes, see 4 holes, first we, ha we had 3 holes now for 12 in 6, 4 holes. So, which path it will take? Yes. So, the lizard will start from 2, then go to 1, 0 and 9. So, 2 plus 1 plus 0 plus 9 will give a total of 12 insects. So, students you will also do in this way. Now coming to homework, do page number 80 and 81 in your book which has been explained in this video. After seeing the video you will do these pages, page number 80 and 81 in your book. Thank you everyone for watching.